Alright guys, so we just got to the basketball gym. Actually, I can't tell you guys where we're at because this is an exclusive gym and I can't even show you guys us playing. I'm going to be doing a test run on the KD9s. Um, this is the shoe that I'm going to be playing with in SneakerCon Atlanta, but not this colorway. So I kind of want to test out the shoe to make sure I can actually play in them. So maybe I won't play in these in Atlanta. We'll see. We'll see how I like them. But um, yeah, we're about to hoop. You know, we're still staying on the grind even though we're not in LA. And uh, I got these actually from the employee store yesterday in Portland for 50% off. So these were like 75 bucks. And then Fire Kicks didn't have any shoes, so I had to offer him my exclusive size 12 gold Jordans to hoop in. So these are super limited, guys. I'm just kidding. I spray painted these gold like two years ago. So how do you use lace locks? No, take the lace locks off. You don't need those. Yeah. I was supposed to give these away a long time ago, but I moved away from the bay, so they've just been sitting in my house. So Fire Kicks is gonna play in them, and then maybe we'll give them away, right? Damn, let's just see. Game worn. Game worn. Yo guys, look at the sky right now. It's freaking beautiful. This is one thing LA doesn't have is this type of view right here. And that's what I miss. What's up? Alright guys, so we're starting, basically starting the vlog here. Um, we're at this restaurant called Ninja Castle. Oh, I didn't know that. That's why you were all black. Huh? Trying to fit in, huh? You feel me? No, it's Nigel. Nigel Castle. <laughs> but anyway, we're about to eat with the fam. Uh, all my cousins are here. You feel me? Fire kids coming along, G. Let's just say you're part of the family. Yeah, right. Feeling blessed. They got karaoke here. Oh, look at the fishies. Hi, fish. Say hi. Show them your teeth. <laughs> say hi, guys. Where's your Yeezys? You got the They're Nikes? still too big. Oh, she got no. the Roches. Roche game. What's up, Mila? Give me five. So I didn't know we were coming to a restaurant like this, but I'm excited now. Stop, man. Oh my god. You got the sushi, the shrimp, the other stuff. I can't have rice. No rice, all of a sudden, no rice. You're so cute. He's a baby. I don't know why. The new Apple. Yes, sir. Oh, since you don't work at Apple anymore, Hi. you can give us the inside info. Hi. 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 Rumor has it the new iWatch is coming out. What do you know to this rumor? It's actually called an Apple Watch. <laughs> what did I say? iWatch. I wa Apple Watch. That's what y'all do, Tiana. Where's Jackson? Hey, you're Tiana. Oh, you're eating I know. Yay! What you got on your feet, cuz? She took that one. You could've put her hands on it. Thank God there's no soccer freaking. I think I'm gonna take Aaron Rodgers. Fam, take Tony Romo, I'm telling you. Tony Romo, fam. Tony Romo. He's doing the fantasy. He's doing NFL fantasy draft. I told him you need to get Tony Romo. You need to get Carson Palmer. And you need to get uh, Peyton Manning. So, those are the top picks for NFL draft. I'm running King's car, bro. Damn, six. six. All right, guys, so today's vlog was pretty dry. We woke up at like, what time? 12 or 1. <laughs> no, we woke up like at 2. We woke up at like 2 and started editing our vlogs because we were just drained from Portland and drained over the past three days of no sleeping. But I thought I would uh, spice up the vlog by showing you guys all of my purchases from Portland. As you guys know, we went to the Adidas store and the Nike store. So you need a pass to get in and then everything in the store is 50% off. So I took advantage, it was my first time there. I've always wanted to go. So I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff I picked up and I'll show you guys the Adidas stuff first because there's a lot less Adidas stuff. The Adidas store, shout out to Heskin, Thanks for getting us in. The Adidas store, as far as footwear, was super dry. There was not that much footwear. I got a lot of dope clothing from there. So I got these red shorts, like running shorts. Zipper pockets. I think that's the most clutch thing when it comes to shorts. These are 40 bucks. I got these for 20 bucks. Next up, I got some Adidas sweatpants shorts. I got these. I don't know how I found these, but then I think Ahmed and YG got these too. You got these, right? Uh, I got the long over. Wait, you got them, those ones too? Yeah. So you got the other ones. I got the red ones, I got these ones. This one's not distressed not, like yours. Yeah, it might distress This one was 33 bucks, so I got this for, what's half of 33? 11.50? Uh, 12. 12. No. 
<laughs> Expose him. Expose him. Let's just say there's a reason why I didn't finish college. What's it called? Huh? <laughs> I got my dad some Adidas polos because this is like his signature. He's, he always rocks polos and he loves Adidas because he's a soccer player. So I got him some Adidas polos. And then I got this jacket right here that I really like. And as you guys can see, it's like a very thin bomber jacket, kind of like a bomber track jacket. And it's, I don't even know what kind of print this is. I kind of see some flowers in there. But then it's like, bar you can barely see, I think you can see it better on the back. Yeah, this one was a hundred bucks, so I got it for 50 bucks. So this is actually part of a collection or something, let me see. Le Sport Nis Pasque, oh wow, this is not even English. And then last from the Adidas store, I got this dope ass light gray hoodie with the green Adidas logo, kind of hard to see. I think I took the tag off of this one, but this one was like 60 bucks, I got it for 30 bucks. But then the thing that I don't like about this that I didn't notice is there's no, front pocket so I don't know if I'm gonna wear this too much but it's still dope a dope colorway <coughs> oh. okay over to the Nike store most of the stuff at the Nike store was basically the same stuff that they have at a Nike town or uh, a regular Nike store so at the Nike employee store I took advantage so we got these shorts right here which are basketball shorts are a little short but I think this is made for the KD9s, so as you guys can see, it's got this dope print on the side. I wore these today when I played basketball, actually. I got this right here, Kyrie t-shirt. I like the color of this. It's like a weird green, but you got the Kyrie logo right there. And then you got crossing, what does it say? Embarrassing defenders since 1992. This one was originally 35 I got it for $18. Some Jordan Compression three-quarter tights my favorite pickup from the whole trip team usa basketball shorts these things go for like 150 bucks i got them for like 75 i think yeah 75 dollars right here look at that tag this is the one that they actually played in in the olympics so this is like the on court the exact same thing as the on court so the quality is really good and then on the inside it's got like this grip so your shirt your shorts don't fall down the eagle right there thing i didn't notice until i put them on this morning is that they don't have pockets because since it's on court there's no pockets they don't need pockets so nike tech shorts if you've ever had nike tech before you know these shorts are freaking amazing because they have this long dope double compartment wait what 70 bucks i got this for 35 bucks and then I got the shorts and I had to get a pair of pants. So I got the Nike Tech pants and the forest olive green, whatever you want to call it. This one is kind of pricey. It's originally a hundred. I got it for 50 bucks. So now going into the shoes, I got three pairs of shoes. And you guys already saw one of them earlier today. I played basketball in these. We got the KD9s in this Rio colorway. So far, so good. They were really dope on court. Next up, I got a pair of Nike... Lunar Epic Fly Knits, multicolor. These really have been catching my eye every time I go to, to a Nike store. And now that I could, had the chance to get them 50% off, I didn't pass it up. I went through like six boxes to find the pattern I like because every single shoe is completely different. The pattern does not the same on any pair. And uh, I got these, the metallic blues, the, the very dope. I've actually wanted these for a while. I just never wanted to pay full price for them. And I got them for 80 bucks as well. So I feel like I'm shooting a crew kicks video all of a sudden. What you doing, fam? You can't see this, G. Oh. 